let's have it, my people. So, new shoe alert. New shoes, new shoes. Boy, Nike makes some good shoes. And these, I caught these because two reasons. I was watching the wear testers. They were talking about the best hoop shoes of 2019 and stuff so far. And I knew these were going to be on the list. They were like maybe number three or number two on the, on their li on his list. Uh, so then I, I just went to look on eBay and stuff. I was like, let me see if they have any for cheap. I found this basically new pair. And they were right up the street. They were $79. And they were in Lake Charles, Louisiana. That's like an hour away from me. So I was like, if I order these, they're going to ship. They're going to be right here. It's not going to take long to ship. Like, I could drive an hour and go pick these up if I wanted to. So I know it's, it's not going to take long to ship. So with no further ado, uh, got these right here. See what's, see what's popping. What's popping with these. Check them out. See if I got what I paid for. I, did I mention? Got these $79. See what this is. Got the box. It's plain uh cardboard looking. Perforated check. Nike basketball. Kevin Wayne Durant. And if you keep up with my channel, you know I'm a LeBron fan. Through and through. I've I've disliked KD ever since he went to the Warriors. I hate that the brother hurt his uh hurt his Achilles and stuff. I knew he was about to hurt his Achilles, man, because that wasn't no calf injury. But the thing about it, I ain't gonna lie. Like his past like three signature shoes, they have been dope. And I have been wanting to kind of get them, but I was like, uh and I my hate for him has died down a little bit. I don't know, I feel bad for him that he, he hurt his his Achilles and stuff. And then this this shoe right here, I I wanted to check these out. So, here they go. The KD12 new signature model. And this box right here, this box is real light. Whenever I grabbed the package this morning, I was like, damn, this, this light. I'm like, I'm thinking it's going to be a good wear. So, here you go with the shoe. It's not a lot going on with it. It's very plain. To me, I think I'm the only person that gets this vibe. And I'm I'm not saying that these are close to these or something. If these, But it has that DNA. To me, it has that kind of fear of God DNA. To me, I I think like this, like that white, that white uh, soul and, and stuff, that clear soul. I don't know that that part right here reminds me of the fear of God's. I'm not saying these are these are some, some fear of God adjacent or anything or man you stupid there ain't no fear of gods but that's what they remind me of too pretty much so getting the technology of it let me see what this this feel like like kind of a, a nylonish type type material so feel like nylonish material I, I've seen reviews on these this tongue it has a, has a very soft tongue. Let me see. Quad axial flywire, multi-directional dynamic containment. So that is what, what the, the upper is. It has that kind of a... Uh, the off... Is that off-white? With they, where they write on, all on the shoes and stuff. The shoes are inverted or whatever. So shoes are starting to try to do that. To try to get that, that feel. What this says on the back. 12th edition 2019 2020 and then on the other side it says Kevin Wayne Durant that's what I'm looking at over here it has a little KD symbol towards the back and back here it has a, a little check that you you can't hardly see has a, has a, a check right here as well then the check is kind of a it's not full the check is kind of cut off it reminds me of those uh those three hundred dollar self lacing uh, Nikes or whatever has flat 
look like like wax type laces almost almost wax maybe maybe it's a wax laces but it's some flat laces mm. nothing on the tip nothing on the tip special see if it, if it has anything it has a signature as a signature behind behind the tongue right there nothing too special in the inside I don't know if you can see let me no shoe tree they get they got some white paper but inside uh, let me try to I doubt you'll be able to see it but if you can it says Kevin Wayne Durant and white white me it's old and right here it's covered up it's covered up with this with this plastic rubber type material and get to the sole of the shoe and the sole is this milky this milky material let's see I feel like it like it would have some grip see a uh, full length full length zoom I think they have zoom in the forefront and in the in the heel uh I'm very very curious as to see how these perform. I want to see how these uh how these fit. I really would would love to go to a gym. I would love to go to a gym and, and get these a test run. Uh the cord that I hoop at, I always say that the cord I hoop at, I can't bring everything out there because these will turn red. These will turn red if I bring them out to the court. And I don't want to actually mess them up like that. But I would like to hoop in them. So I will try to get some kind of performance out of them. Next time I do hit a gym, I will bring these. These will be what I bring. These are very light. I'm going to do an on foot. And when I come back, I'm going to tell you how the uh, how the fit is. And how they, how they fit to me. Because they, they have many videos. These aren't brand new. They came out maybe like two months ago. Uh, maybe more. I think it's like two months ago. Kevin Durant always put his shoes out towards the end of the season and stuff. I don't know why he do that. He don't put his shoes out at the beginning of the year like most sneaker people do. He come out at the end of the year. He brings out a signature shoe before the playoffs starts. But that's that's his his thing that he does. Wonder where he about to go. But uh, on foot time. Down and pitching, say I'm wishing, pitch I'm chasing. Why you hating on my greatness? Dodging Satan, see you waiting, putting doubt inside my head. I'm losing patience. That's the beginning of your demise when you start having negative thoughts inside. But I'm filled with pride and stubborn as the fuck. Gotta get it, you can't wait on luck. Stagnant patterns have you feeling stuck. Nigga hopping caught inside this rut, but I won't give up. It's never gonna happen. I will never give it to the max. Looking up, climbing up the ladder. Underneath my family full of sadness. Depression, man, is running through my veins. Gotta get away, cause it's a strain. Life of pain, but see. But there's the game, pit in the bottom, I will go with game. Came from bottoms, we done broke a change, but I can't lie, I want a copper chain. Nigga, shit, we want material things, and I guess that I'm a little vain. Always thought that I would be the man, sitting back was thinking of a plan, but it failed because too soon I ran. Want success, but it go through my hands. There are things you gotta understand, it will come, but not right when you want it. Just stick with it, wait until your moment. Live my life like I was in a coma, full of darkness, never went nowhere. Dropped a lot of tears, nobody cared. Fuck. My ambitions as I'm riding, 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 My ambitions as I'm riding, riding, riding. So, after trying these on and stuff, it's a, it's a nice light shoe. I see why the price point could be a little cheaper than, than some other shoes. Like the support and stuff doesn't seem all the way there. Uh, I think a guard like a lighter guard like a Kyrie or something would definitely perform well in these i can i can maybe see how kd might have hurt himself in like being a larger athlete you think you would want maybe a little bit more support like uh i'm pretty sure cutting and doing certain things would these would serve a purpose like as far as like me i'm i'm 140 something i don't weigh much so i don't have a lot of pressure on me but if I'm seven foot, two hundred something pounds, barely two hundred something, because he, he a skinny cat. But I can see how maybe you can these can potentially have have a little bit of problems. The lockdown doesn't feel all the way there, but they do feel very comfortable. They feel like a Kyrie. 
to me. Uh, LeBron shoes are heavier and stuff, but I can maybe see why he doesn't get hurt too too much because his shoes you in there they they some bricks. Maybe that serves a purpose. Maybe that that says a little something. I remember Derrick Rose's first couple signature shoes whenever his stuff was popping, popping. Like, it introduced, like, a, a very light shoe. And Derrick Rose's shoes at the time were the lightest in the game. And he's stuck getting hurt. So maybe some, there is something said for uh, stability in, in your shoes. Uh, but maybe I'm just on a rant. Because back in the days, man, people were... Like Ewans with big bricks and shit like that, and but people did get hurt, but more towards the end of their careers and stuff. But I don't know. I'm just ranting, so I don't know what why he got hurt. He probably could have had some some lead shoes on, and probably still would have got hurt. It just was in the cards. Uh, but I do like the shoe. I'm not trying to trying to diss it and be like oh, you're gonna get hurt if you wear these. Nah, because I'm gonna hoop in them, and hopefully I don't hurt myself. But I didn't tie them up. I just put them on. But they is no problem putting these on. You could just you could just slip these on. But I don't have them. I had them laced up like this. Like maybe if I lace them all the way, you could feel that lockdown. So before I even uh finish this video out, let me try to to tie these. So now They feel good. They feel good as far as uh, I, I feel like they are on my foot. Uh, they're not gonna, they're not going anywhere. Uh, as far as that aspect, like lockdown feel, mm, I still feel it feels they're like a mid, but they feel like they have like the protection of like a low. Like I feel like I can, I can move as far as like as much as I want to. But I don't feel like they would they would really protect me too much in case like like a roll my ankle or anything thing of the sorts. Like they still feel like loose in that aspect. I don't know. But they, they do feel feel good. They do have a broken in feel. Like they, they say that about this shoe, like these shoes you don't have to uh have to really do too much to them. You uh you put them on and you can just go. So I feel like I can put these on and just go and play and I won't feel crazy about the shoe. I won't feel like uh they they need to be broken in or anything. They are fresh out the box, able to play. You you put the gas in the whip, you put the put the key in, room and you <laughs> you can shoot out. You ain't gotta warm the car up. But uh hopefully you like the video. Like, comment, subscribe, gonna be the greatest of the most hated. Shane new things coming. Supposed to have something probably tomorrow. Yeah, subscribe to the channel. Uh, follow me on social media in the descriptions and all that. Peace out.